Sharon, the short girl picker here. We are off on a thrifting adventure today. We are heading down to Raleigh, Durham, North Carolina. This is somewhere different for us. We're gonna hit up some thrift stores that we've never been to, and hopefully we'll find some really cool treasures. Thank you so much, and I'll see you soon. Next stop is going to be a Goodwill. Um, this looks like a smaller one, but you never know what you're gonna find. It looks like we're gonna have to park it looks like the parking is already pretty crowded here. So we're going to find a little spot and and get uh, get pulled in here. All right. So we did make it into the Goodwill. I know what that one is. Did grab a lands and Christmas sweater, which obviously I'll have to check, but it's kind of a big size and it's pretty. So even if it has to sit, I can pick it up and that's okay. Um, these sass shoes look okay. <clears throat> Excuse me, I'm not sure what size. They're a seven narrow. Well, here's another pair right down here. I wonder if these are also going to be a seven there. They kind of look like the same person's shoes. Um, let's see what else we're going to find here. Those are some Vince Camitos. Oh, I do like those. What do these look like? Nope. The buckles all torn up so that we can't take those. Well, here's a pair of nice, I actually have a pair of these in black in my, in my store right now and I do think that they're going to sell pretty quick so I'll probably take the brown pair too. Alright, let's see what else we have here. Those look pretty. I was looking at those boots down there, but they look pretty beat up. What are these? Oh, these are nice. Okay. If these are in good condition, I will take these. You know, I, I don't have a shopping cart here. I think I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to need one. So I don't know if that is a thing here or not. Because I've only made it through. You know, let's see if we grab one of these baskets. I'm gonna grab one of these baskets. I kind of wanted a shopping cart, but I guess a basket will have to do. So we'll pick this up. Now I am not used to shopping like this, so this there might be a lot of stop and go involved in this. Maybe Carl will come and hold the basket for me just so I can have a hand. But um, he already ran off somewhere, but that's okay. I don't blame him. So I'm going to put this down for a second. Like I said, I'll have to drop it every time I want to look at something. What are those? Nine and Company. Those are pretty. What about those? Nope. Aerosols. I think what I'll do is I'll just leave my basket on the ground for a minute so I can actually look at things. And then I'll come back and grab it. Kind of sounds like a better plan. Ugh. Okay, now we're on the next aisle. They do have some rock ports there, some aerosols. Those are not real Birkenstocks, I can tell because they don't say Birkenstock anywhere on them. Um, oh, these are nice. Look at these little coal haunts, those are really cute but the um, patent leathers already come off on the side of them. So I am gonna leave those. And then we'll come back up here. See what some of these are. Oh, those are Kenneth Coles, Clark's, Liz Claiborne's. These, the aerosols are completely coming out of the insides. So those, those will have to stay. What are these right here? Buckles. Uh, 
Oh, look at the Tory birches. Though. Those are fabulous. Now, they don't, I am, I'm looking for breaks. Um, they just need a little bit of cleaning, actually. Um, the front, the front is missing a little, uh, I don't know if that's that, that bad. It might just be like a little rub on it. See what the undersides look like. You know what? These are not bad. I think with a little cleanup, those might look okay. So we're going to take those. What size are they too? I'm just curious. They are, oh, they're a 10. Wow, okay. These are pretty high too, honestly. These are, are quite high for um, a pair of espadrilles. I am making sure that the, the, the um, buckles, the, I was sorry, I was checking to make sure the buckles were okay because there's nothing worse than getting it home and, you know, the buckles are broken. So I do have to make sure I, I check things. Um, I'm sure at this point you're noticing that this is not as organized and, and well done as, as my goodwill. I, I know that you guys have noticed that. <laughs> So yes, I guess I am a little spoiled when I'm at home. Okay. But you never, you never know what you're going to find, you know? This is Cloud by Nine West. Oh, these are box. Oh, wait a minute. Now see, I don't know. I'm not sure. I got some damage. Yeah, I think it is damage. It looks like it's on both sides. So I'm gonna leave those. Those those were cute though, but there's there's just a lot of damage on those. So I'm gonna think I'm gonna leave those right where they are. And I got some other shoes here too. What are those? Sticky? Nope. Okay, I feel like I kind of, well, here's a pair of Brightons down here. Let's see what these look like. Mm, I don't think I'm that fond of those, so I think I'm going to leave those right there, and we'll just keep on going. So I've already been through the purses, and that wasn't, um, I didn't see much over there I had to have. So we're going to come over there. And we're going to look at this stuff. Because, you know, I'm always like my holiday stuff. Oh, no, this is a big one. Look at the size of that. I haven't seen this piece in a while. Um, I've had I've had this piece before, but this, the smaller version. Yeah, I've had this one in the smaller version. He looks like... He doesn't look like his batteries are going to work, but you know what? I think I'm just going to leave him right there. We've got all the costumes and everything. All right, let's keep on going this way. Sorry, excuse me. We'll come on this way. We'll go through the hard gets. Here is some makeup bags and stuff. Well, let's see what we have in here. Because you can find some high-end makeup bags in here. I have I have grabbed some at the Goodwill before where the makeup bag alone was was worth a good penny or two. So we'll we'll look through the makeup bags and see if we see anything that's that's um you know like vintage or high-end. this last one right here nope see this one's brand new but that's bath and body work so i think we'll just leave that one the the um the handle is completely gone on it so we'll just keep on going and we got belts 
So I guess the belts are just put in a in a box here. But they're not hung up. Everything kind of feels like it's falling around me. Yeah, I think I'm gonna be okay with not doing that. So let's keep on going. Some pieces right there. Uh, chickens. Oh, so we had a collection of chickens up here. Oh, this pair went imports. It's kind of cute. Somebody's rooster collection. Yep, yeah, somebody had a rooster collection. I would agree. That plate is really cute, too. Yeah, yeah. Did you see the plate? Yeah, it's cute. All right, let's keep on going. Really? Never? Yeah. That's really cute. It says it's a large, but obviously that is not a large in, in my size, but any, any means. Oh, that's pretty too. This looks like it might be like an anthropology or something. That is very pretty. Hmm. I do have to check out my items though before I get out of here and um, and see, make sure there's no flaws or anything in those things. Yeah, I wouldn't be surprised if this isn't an anthropology dress. That one's real pretty too, but obviously the size is uh, a lot smaller. Well, I don't think I'm going to spend all my time looking at clothes just because I know I don't have a ton of time today so I don't know if they have a high-end rack here or a cabinet where they keep the nicer stuff so I guess maybe we'll kind of just wander up to the front and I'll find that out Hey YouTubers, I just want to give you a quick recap of the things I bought. I am in North Carolina. I stopped at a Goodwill. I got a Christmas sweater that was $5. Uh, it's Land's End. It's a 2XL. It was $5.19. I also got a pair of Cole Hans penny loafers. They're men's. $3.99. That was even cheaper than my Goodwill. I got a beautiful, beautiful Rebecca Minkoff uh, purse that I paid $8.99 for. And I got a pair of Bach boots that were a total of $5. 29 these are really really these are going to clean up beautifully kind of a distressed black really soft leather um so my about my total spent there at, at that goodwill was about 25 dollars so um that was kind of a nice nice find to find things a little less expensive at a goodwill now we are at the trosa thrift store and we're about to go in and see what this place is all about i'll check back with you guys soon